going on everybody Dan O here from everyday's turkey day and this video is going to be on the reason why a lot of people don't like Lonzo Ball now if you watched the game recently with the Lakers versus the Clippers you saw how Patrick Beverly kind of bullied Lonzo um, he got in his face called him a bitch obviously he's trying to get into his head um, and I doubt he has really anything you know personal against him but regardless man a lot of people don't like Lonzo and they're going to be gunning for him this season and mainly obviously as most of you probably already know that's because it's because of his dad his dad ran his mouth a lot um and to be honest I don't have a problem with his dad um he seems like a pretty funny dude and you know he seems like a great dad I mean shit I grew up without a dad so goddamn. but uh anyways you know his dad just you know kept talking shit kept saying this and that and really like Lonzo and shit even all his brothers seem like they really haven't even said much to the media if you see interviews with them they may be only getting like one to two words edgewise and it's mainly just their dad going off and saying a whole bunch of shit so really the only thing man I even remember Lonzo saying that could maybe have gotten a few people pissed off at him was uh, his comments about Nas and how like Nas is a real hip hop and he listens to Future and shit like that which if you look at Lonzo's age, what's he, like, 20 years old, 21? Like, that's, that's not that hard-pressed, you know? Like, it's, it's pretty obvious he's a young dude. You know, that's what people are listening to nowadays. And if you didn't grow up listening to that uh, type of shit like Nas or whatever, then it's it's not too far-fetched that he wouldn't really say that Nas is real hip-hop, even though, of course, everybody knows he is. But regardless, that's, that's, like, the only thing Lonzo's ever said that I can see somebody being, like, really pissed off at him about. So more so, yeah, it's his, it's his pops, it's his dad, you know. He kind of put this big target on Lonzo's back, which, you know, probably helped the shoe business um, and probably helped Lonzo get drafted number two to the Lakers. But at the end of the day, Lonzo's going to have to come out this season and prove a lot, man. And granted, you know, he did just play, you know, in a, <clears throat> the preseason, you know what I'm saying, in a couple games, but... Regardless, um, he's new to the league. It's going to take time for him to adjust. And at the end of the day, um, do I think he'll be a superstar? Maybe. I think he has potential. But, you know, it's going to take time for him to find out, you know, the speed, the play style. It's, it's going to take time for him to get molded into what he needs to be for that team. You know, he's not going to just come right out the gate and, you know, drop 25 points and 10 assists, you know. So that's my thoughts on that. Leave a comment, subscribe. Peace.